One in five Americans has a tattoo. That's more than 63 million people. Tattoo removal is now faster and easier than ever before with a new laser that just got approved by the FDA. A new laser. It looks harmless, but it can burn off the toughest tattoo in minutes. You can hear the laser working. In minutes, the ink butterfly wing starts to fade. Michelle decided it was time when the dermatologist she works for, Rutledge Forney, invested in a new Picashore laser. She says it can remove a tattoo in half the treatments of other lasers because Picashore is powerful. This laser, it's the first innovation in laser tattoo removal in at least 20 years. It actually fires. When I fire the laser, the pulse only lasts one trillionth of a second. So what that means is the energy goes in very quickly and breaks the tattoo ink into millions of tiny, tiny little pieces that your body's able to absorb very quickly. A bad decision made in here used to take almost a year to get removed until now. Dallas Cosmetic Surgery Center, Skintastic, is offering a new innovative treatment for tattoo removal that's faster and less painful. Believe it or not, oh, well. we're done. I can't believe it, I like wanna cry. Dr. Geronimus was able to get rid of Liam's tattoo with just two treatments with a new laser called PicoShore. With the PicoShore laser, removing tattoos just got faster. Two words to describe the PicoShore laser, effective and reliable. The PicoShore concept has been out there for a while. Uh, this was first discussed in the laser field almost 20 years ago, and no company was able to build a device safely and reliably. So when we first received the device, I was worried that it would break down all the time and it wouldn't be reliable pulse to pulse, but in fact, just the opposite was true. It's a very reliable laser, and the consistency of the laser beam has been terrific. Clinically, what surprised us was the rapidity in which we were able to get rid of many of the tattoos, uh, particularly with blue and green inks, which in the past, was very, very difficult to get rid of. Now it's gone from our most difficult problem to our easiest colors to remove. So the blue and green, which would often take us 10, 15, 20 treatments to remove, now we can offer remove in one to three sessions. Other colors, uh, like black, respond much more quickly with this compared to older lasers like the Q-switch lasers. So overall, uh, we're seeing much more rapid removal of tattoo ink with the PicoShore technology. The big advance in laser treatment of tattoos was using ultra-short pulses to fragment the tattoo ink. Those were nanosecond particles, billionths of a second. The Pico is trillionths of a second, 100 times shorter than the nanosecond domain tattoo lasers. So we can fragment the tattoo particles better, faster, probably into smaller particles of dust that dust is carted away, so we get more improvement per treatment, and it's because of that ultra-short pulse duration. Yeah, I think it's a quantum leap. It's a hundred-fold shorter pulse. It is a major change in the ability of lasers and physicians using the lasers to treat tattoos and probably all kinds of pigmented lesions. The evolution and technical expertise of the manufacturers to put together a reliable picosecond laser is extremely exciting. The ability to use a shorter pulse and higher energy means that you need to use less energy to cause a stress fracture. If you use less energy, uh, there should be more rapid healing and even less issue with potentially leaving any textural change in the skin. And so that's, uh, you, you get all kinds of benefits from simply shortening the pulse. Well, we see much more clearing per treatment. So patients come back and you see incremental improvement with each treatment. In the study we did, we saw that we basically doubled the rate of clearing or have the number of treatments needed compared to the controls in the big studies done over the last 10 to 20 years. And in the clinic, patients come in and we've got multiple colors clearing but with no increase in risk. That's the key. We're not trading results with side effects. Some of the patients uh, we treated have been previously treated and, and had, you know, run out of options and run out of treatments. And we see these patients all the time. Uh, so after a patient has had five treatments or 10 treatments, or I'm seeing someone now who's had 30, which is hard to imagine, but they just wanted to get rid of it. Well, it gets 
frustrating. So to have something that will take it from a, from a standstill, from having a roadblock and be able to get around that and go further is very exciting to them. So they're extremely pleased. Well, it's really been fantastic. Patients now come in and we can say, we have something that will revolutionize the treatment of your tattoo. Instead of 20 plus treatments, we can say it's gonna be more like six to 12. It'll hurt the same, the side effects will be the same, but we'll clear it much faster. And that's really music to their ears because people with tattoos, they don't want them cleared in two years, they want them cleared this year. And so they're very excited about the fact that we finally have something that's new, scarless removal of tattoos, great results, no increase in side effects, no increase in risk. Frankly, it's been a boon to these patients. Well, the benefit is that you can offer a treatment uh, which is more rapidly and more thoroughly effective in a shorter period of time. The treatment of tattoos uh, has been frustrating for people who have tattoos and for the physicians treating the tattoos. And the reason is that it takes multiple treatments the treatments are uncomfortable or painful. Uh, there's a cost to the patient associated with it. There's a cost to the physician for the lasers themselves. And it's often impossible to clear the tattoo completely. So after all this time and pain and expense, there's still part of the tattoo left. You may not be able to see what the design was. It may look like a smudge or some dirt, but it's frustrating to everyone involved not to be able to get rid of a tattoo. So to be able to do so more easily and more thoroughly with fewer treatments and just less fuss overall, you know, is a quantum leap forward. Ever since I've had it, I've regretted it tremendously. I can't wear bathing suits that show it. It's just and the older you get, the worse it is. So I started doing some research with my doctor and the PicoSure laser was one of the most recommended uh, laser removals uh, that are currently being done. So I will tell you, every time I see a green tattoo walk in the door, or I should say a person with a green tattoo walk in the door, I, I definitely um, smile knowing that we will have great success in helping them clear that tattoo. It's safe to say I love the device. It's usually, if, if not always, my, my first line go-to device for tattoo removal. Uh, unlike the other uh, available technologies, the delivery, it's a picosecond pulse duration compared to the other technologies which are quality switch in the nanosecond range. There's definitely still uses for the other devices. Again, we select which wavelength and device as well as uh, parameters based on the individual uh, and the tattoo that we're treating but more often than not, it's, it's the Pico Shure that I turn to first. Hi, I'm Janine, I'm 30 years old and I'm a beauty journalist living in New York City. I'm excited to try the Pico Shure laser today. I've had a tattoo um, that I despised for about 11 years. I hated it the second I got it and it's time to finally try to get it removed. I'm a journalist, so I'll, I'm happy that I could share with an audience what it really feels like to go through tattoo removal. In the clinical trial, we treated a couple patients who had with pigmented lesions who did not have tattoos, who had lentigines or age spots, uh, and they cleared readily uh, in one or two treatments. So I would expect that that the use of the picosecond laser will be uh, common and probably the most useful laser uh, available for pigment lesions. The other area where we're using the Pico Short laser uh, is for rejuvenation of the skin, photo rejuvenation, and we've been using what's called a diffractive lens array. It's an attachment to the laser itself, and this allows us to treat uh, the photo-damaged, sun-damaged skin non-invasively with no, absolutely no wounding of the skin. The ability to treat patients with no wounding in terms of rejuvenating their skin has been very, very important. So we're now dealing with something that's really different than what's been out there before. It's, it's a new concept. The idea of picosecond pulses has not been on the market before. And what we're finding is that there's some very unique indications. So that is of significant interest 
to many physicians who are in this field. I think there's certainly more to go. Again, this is the first laser of its kind, the picosecond pulseration. We're learning more and more with each trial, each week, each month, what we can do with the device. It went from tattoos to revitalization. We'll see where we go next. My practice, uh, there's been a significant change. Uh, we're now better at tattoo removal. Uh, we're better at photo rejuvenation. I think if you're a physician and you're treating tattoos in your practice, frankly, if you don't have a picosure, you do not have the best technology available on the market, and you're not offering your patients what they need. And frankly, they're gonna go elsewhere because the word will get out pretty quickly that there's something better than the technology which, as of today, is old. Nanosecond technology to treat tattoos is old technology in 2013. Pico is new, and if you want to be at the cutting edge, you want to treat tattoos quickly and efficiently, you want the best technology available with no increased risk of side effects, you frankly have no choice. The patients will figure it out. They are smart in this environment. Go on the online, boom. Pico, sure, do you have it? They'll be calling the office saying, do you have it, yes or no? I would definitely say that I am surprised to see how well known the device has become so quickly amongst the, the lay person. More and more, it's not that I'm seeing individuals being referred from other, by other physicians who are aware of the device, but individuals who are seeking out the Pico Shore specifically, knowing either because they have the certain colors that are best treated with the device, or they've had less than ideal treatment experiences thus far, and they're looking for the Pico Shore specifically. The Pico Shore concept is still beginning. You know, it's still novel, it's still new. Uh, we will find other indications for this and perhaps there'll be modifications going forward that can lead us to even better treatments and better concepts for our patients. Uh, as time goes along, as these devices enter the field, you'll have innovative physicians and a body of experience which will lead to even more treatments. But the story is still untold and I think we'll see more and more changes and more improvements in technology and more indications for this, tech, this particular technology in the future.